Hi friends, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My name is China, also known as Sugar Doll Plans or Sugar Box Stickers, whichever you prefer. And this is a haul bit um, for August. This is the first round of Happy Mail that I have received so far. We shall see what else comes in. Slowly been kind of trying to make like a plan for kits. Not that I'm opposed to hoarding kits at this point because art is just too good to pass up. Um, I think when art wasn't that great I was like a lot more picky but so far like the artists are insane. Um, just when kit styles used to be different though I was a lot more picky. So anyways so yeah I'm now officially a kit hoarder um, and my friends can laugh at me but anyways let's go ahead and start with like what's going to be the quickest to get through which is going to be this paper shire order and shop really beautiful and then we'll save spc for last so give me one moment i am unfortunately going to have to turn the fan on the lights are hot it is currently 81 degrees and it is 10 30 we are in the dog days of summer um august is like absolutely the worst where i live so I was like looking forward to this week because I had saw on the forecast that um, the weather was going to drop. Today was the high was 93. I know that like all the Texans are probably like laughing at me but our humidity is and I understand Texas also has bad humidity in certain parts. Our humidity is 79% so though it is 81 degrees you can't really see because of my privacy screen um, it says it is 87 at nine o'clock at night. I mean, not nine, 10 30. So I'm gonna have to turn the fan on and I'm very sorry. I just can't do it. I'm sweating so before I even get into it. So yeah, this is uh, the misery, which is crazy. Um, sorry, I was just looking at my mom's uh, where she lives and it is actually not as hum. Actually, I think it's the same as, hum like humidity is higher, but it doesn't feel as hot as it does here and she doesn't live that far away so that's fun but anyways you know tomorrow we got 95 90 and then finally hopefully in a week pretty much essentially we will get 79 i would love for just like 80s 70s so yeah low 80s mid 70s all of that i love a mid 70s Ooh, mid 70s is my fave so anyways I'll try to speak louder and enunciate over the fan. The air conditioning did not kick on, so we're going to have to roll with it. I mean, it's on, but it hasn't, like, hit the temperature where it thinks it needs to get colder. So, anyways, and tea ways, um, first up first, first things first, we're going to have Shop for the Beautiful here, and I don't know if I... I should have had six refills if not I don't really care I don't really go through my pins that quickly so not that pressed but anyways we have some pins here and I'll go ahead and take them out of the container um I think some were on sale I don't know um and I had also ordered from her pin day sale I don't always like consistently buy shop for the beautiful um but I just can't help help myself whenever I notice that she's saying that you know there's a sale or something like that so I think this is supposed to be Elsa because there was a Disney like another Disney inspired release that came out so this is Elsa I'm pretty sure I love the colors and I love the gems inside and then this one is best day ever hold on it doesn't say the price on them so I don't know on the invoice but this is best day ever and it's got like white with silver hardware it's like not wanting to focus focus come on there we go white with silver hardware okay it's going like out of focus again let me move these no why is it focusing on that there we go, white with silver hardware and then blue, pink, and white crystals on the inside and it has these little Mickey crystals. I don't think you can really see. You might be able to see, I'm not sure. I can't tell from my viewfinder. So super cute, you know, I love Disney. Best day ever, hashtag best day ever. So I figured I could use that in a like Disney planner or use it when I do like 
promotions and stuff like that. Uh, not a Disney planner, but like setting up a planner with Disney stuff. So then we have, this is, this should be Botiful 2.0, which is just this pretty pink with black hardware. It is matte, I think, or satin. And then black crystals. Love that. And then this one should be Puget Sound, and it was a defect. Um, I don't really notice anything wrong with it. Maybe like here. Nope, that's just dust. Yeah, so I don't notice anything wrong, but hey, it is what it is. Don't really care. So it's this kind of like blue, like a cornfield blue, I want to say. And it has these pretty um, sparkles inside and silver hardware. So that is Puget Sound, I want to say. I want to say it is. Or maybe this is Puget Sound. I have no clue. You guys can pair. Com compare. This one might be Puget Sound. That one might have been um, Goal Getter. I don't really feel like looking up on the website right now, but you can check the website to confirm. Obviously, there's no like pictures to confirm on this. I can check my shop app. Let me see. Hold on. Let's see the shop app. Making sure my phone's not in view. Do, 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 do. Let's see. So I think this one's the gold getter. Okay, so this one is gold getter. I love this blue color once again. They're kind of similar. This one's obviously a little bit lighter. Um, but this one's got like a platinum chrome titanium chrome kind of finish of the metal and then this has like lighter colored crystals very pretty so this one's Puget Sound I like them both no preference um, and then let's see this one here should be lilac crystal which is a rose gold color hardware but it's okay I think the crystals are really pretty and I do like the color of the pin it is shiny it's not really that matte so yeah that was my shop Villa Beautiful order or Villa Beautiful order here are my pen refills and then you have some stickers here from probably I think they're um, like subscription box so it says start somewhere today trust the journey this is the bell town sampler with blues and then you have this journaling card with the pens um it looks like some wooden items like a butterfly a mushroom a bird on like a bow tray very vintage looking and then it's just like a thank you card so that's that so then we have paper shire um love this journaling card so much a little cinnamon roll or dessert pastry whatever speaks to my soul especially the coffee as well not huge on the journaling i do try but i'm not great at it i need to though and then we have these suitcases and more books and then all of these flowers and then this is just the thank you for the a5 size journaling card and then i think you also get a6 uh, with the pantones um, with the new like way that she gives you tiered freebies so let's open this come on out so this is Pantone Beach Blue this is so cute and so much detail it's just adorable and then here we have my tiered freebies so we have the all orders and then we have the 20 pounds orders freebies. So that is my freebies. I guess I, I don't know if I had, I don't think I mentioned any um, discounts at the checkout. I don't know. Maybe this was my anniversary order. So anyways, I picked up the besties um, with the red hair. My best friend's hair is not this color of red. She's not a ginger red. She's like a like a cherry coke kind of red, I would say, uh, with blonde. Um, 
I don't know how they call them, like face framing bits, I don't know. But I did think this could work for marking stuff, even though like she um, is in Canada right now, but she should hopefully be back, so that would be fun to mark stuff when I see her. This is wrong side of the bed, what a mood. This is the conveyor sushi. I haven't gone to one, but I really want to go to one. Um, hopefully soon. We'll see, question mark. Then I have the takeaway coffee. I'm obsessed with these. They're so cute. Then we have the shut up vanillas. We have fancy sandwiches. Um, we have the night shift. Ice cream tubs. We have Nutella or chocolate hazelnut. Yeah, Nutella. I wonder if you can't say it because of trademarking. Then we have ironing. We have day off. Vanilla with dishes, office cubicle vanillas, um, cafe drinks, super cute. I'm obsessed with these. I love their drink doodles. Then we have vanilla cinema, perfect for going to the movies. I always look like that. Do if you go to the movies, let me know. I go to Alamo, so they have really good food. So I don't really need to bring outside food. I might bring like candy. Don't tell anyone. Shh. Wink, wink. Cause I'm not paying five dollars for their candy when I could just go to 7-Eleven down the street or order on Amazon but um I just get their food it is kind of pricey but it's worth it because I don't really even go to the movies that often so let me know what you guys do when you go to the movies um in the comments down below this is baking equipment which is perfect I did just bake and then we have airplane perfect because I am going on a vacation next month in September the end of September and then we have frenemies and then we have tea bags and teapots so that is my paper shower order super in love with it super happy and then here last but not least we have an SPC um, let me get my invoices out we have an SPC uh, Christmas in July two orders so Let's open this. We have our colors of the week as well as a freebie. Oh, I missed this over here. I got some foil bundles. Um, at first I only went in for like two kits, a few, two foil bundles, I want to say, and I don't know what else. Oh, apparently I did not realize this was the label sample rose. <laughs> I thought it was a different label sampler, but that's okay. I thought it was the matte label sampler, like the foiled one. Oh well. I can de-stash those in a giveaway or something like that. I, yeah, I thought I was getting the, like, what's it called? I don't know. I did get a script grab bag and a sticker grab bag. And then a foil misfit sticker grab bag, and then a label sampler grab bag, and then a sticker misfit grab bag. So then we have some foil bundles, or four foil bundles, two kits. Uh, that's it. And then in the other order, we have the color of the week edition, uh, limited edition doodles. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. Uh, what's it called? Eight. What is the word? Eight foil bundles. Sorry. All right. So first things first. Over here, the stack. We have a J Crew. I love this powder blue color. A J Crew plans um freebie. Super cute. I'm obsessed. I love this color. I also love her mint one. And then we have this freebie here of the like overlays. I hate spiders, but it's fine. We have gold, silver, rose gold, uh, hollow, and sparkly hollow. The sparkly hollow is kind of hard to get besides right here. The rest is kind of, the pattern is too fine, but it doesn't matter. Gonna have all the Halloween things. And then we have my script grab bag here. So let's do that. 
So I have meaning in silver, which I can always use, pull time in rose gold. Can't really always use because I'm not a huge rose gold person. We have laundry in silver, meal prep in rose gold, school in rose gold. Could use that. Homework in gold, grocery run in hollow. We have email in silver. I don't really mark doing emails, but I could maybe use that in like a pre plan planner. We have draw in rose gold and then movie night in rose gold. Not a huge rose gold fan, but hey, it is what it is. So then. Um, I picked up the Spooky Magic add-ons. We have Fam 2. I uh, love this. These, uh, I always get Fam 2, and I love this girl being spookified because she's usually a part of the um, 50th, I think. She was originally a part of the 50th uh, anniversary fashion girl. So then we have the Disney version of the <laughs> colored doodles other way and then we have the um, standard doodles and then we have the extra orange um, what's it called labels and then we have the extra label add-on for spooky magic so then here we have spooky party um, doodles and then I got the fashion girl uh, two and the fashion girl one and then the extra color so cute and then this is the 75 plus freebie in this like tan color so then here is the I don't know which one is which oh my god I don't know what's like a rack I know one is a rack somewhere so the sprinkle um, header overlays in gold we have these rose gold bows, we have these gold hearts overlays, we have the hollow hearts overlays, we have these rose gold icons, hollow bows, hollow stars, um, silver bows, we have the Scribble Prince Co. Um, and gold script, and then hollow like star bottom washi, you can definitely use that, and then we have another think this is a rack or a grab bag not sure um, we have the rose gold gems we have these silver deco bows we have this New York City um, deco foil deco we have this that looks like an 80s 90s inspired just geometric shapes we have these sparkly hollow icons and food we have these months in silver month countdown or count up and then we have this like uh kind of like i don't know how to call it uh like gold lines it's kind of like lines hollow gold lines there you go um confetti overlays these hollow mickey confetti head overlays gonna use that for sure um, this overlay this says, if you be my star, I'll be your sky, and then it has, like, the moon and the stars, and then it has some headers, deco, and deco bits, and gold. I, I don't know if I've ever seen that come to shop. And then this is a uh, baby thing, which I don't really do de-sashes anymore, um, but maybe I will just de-sash everything just from this, the two things that I don't need, so... Um, this is a baby thing. I have it as the like newer script. I don't prefer this script, so that's that. And then we have this um, grab bag here. Let's see. So here we have this like outdoor movie night, and you can put the movies from over here to over here. I don't think I have this kit. So I probably will be de-stashing this. And we have some glitter headers. I don't know which kit they're from. Maybe control alt delete. Um, and then we have this page here from like a Father's Day kit. We have this bottom washi here. I don't remember what kit this is. Um, let's see. We have um, this kit here from like a travel kit. I mean this page here from like a travel kit. We have another thing of bottom washi here. Don't know where that's from. We have like a pastel Thanksgiving, all of that here. 
We have this. I don't remember this one. Maybe like from a home kit, I want to say. This seems like fall. It might have been from a fall kit. This is a monthly, so that's cool. I might hold on to this. I don't know if it's, I think it's for A5, but I might hold on to this um, just in case, even though I don't have a sidebar. And then we have these little things here. I mean, I might hold on to these to like do test stuff for my shop. I think this is from like one of the anniversaries. So, or just be able to pull on stuff because I don't keep leftovers, but I don't know. We'll see. And then we have the foil bundles. So we have the gold, like, celebration party foil bundle. Um, we have the sparkly hollow one. Then I got the, um, like, glitter rainbow um, star foil bundle. And then I picked up the, like, chunky, what is this called? Um, this is called Starry Gold Star Foil Bundle, and then I picked up Spooky Magic, not something I would be using this year, but maybe, you know, in the future whenever I go back to Disney for Halloween, because I already used it last year, and then, um, it has this tall box, and then we have Spooky Party, which I might use for my birthday, um, I don't know, we'll see what else comes out, but then it has this double box scene here as the add-on, so, yeah. That is the kits that I picked up. So then going over here, we do have another freebie. This is from Maddie. It is like a glitter um, icons. Uh, I I think Andrea should have just made this whole entire bag like <laughs> the pattern because it's very hard to see the glitter <laughs> on the uh, Walmart bag sign. But um, and also she didn't do the the can. Oh, but it's super cute. I could definitely use the nail polish, the dog leash, um, the nuggets, uh, the game, the pencil, the planner, the soda, and the TV. Probably wouldn't use the bus. I could use the Walmart, it doesn't matter. I don't go to Long John Silver's. I don't even know where there's one close to us. And then the Texas, I, I would use maybe one day whenever I go to Texas, but not anytime soon. So anyways. Under the colors of the week, we have them in 10, page 10, page 9, page, or sheet 8, sheet 7, sheet 6, sheet 5, sheet 4, sheet 3, sheet 2, and sheet 1, the Disney page, and then we have this gorgeous, like, neutrals, 75 plus doodles, I love this color, I wish you would do would do a color of the week for this whenever you know people need neutrals i feel like my friend cindy she loves neutrals i feel like that would be very useful for her um let me open this label sampler i'm probably just going to use this for like testing stickers and stuff like that so because i have at this point i've thrown away all my like leftover kits so and it overwhelms me to have them all but hey what am i gonna do so let's see does this want to come out this is an old format. And I guess I could hold on to them and see, like, if I needed to match them with kits or something or use a kit from a different shop. It doesn't want to come out. Oh, my God. It's, like, tight in there. Let me just... Come on. Let's see. Here we go. So we have this like pink to gray we have this pastels and gray this is from uh the christmas magic i can hold on to this because i have this kit i don't know what this one's to but i do like the colors a lot um this i don't know what this one's to either it feels like a halloween kit maybe from last year i feel like i could have a kit with this art like fall cabin or something then we have the uh dark blue light blue grayish white and then red then we have this sheet here like a kind of like a sage green almost a little bit less sage though almost like aqua pink white and gray lots of good colors that you could bring in that could probably match with stuff and we have burgundy beige green and blue we have these pastel colors of pink green blue and purple and then we have these um like salmon pinky like nude pink light blue kind of and then a 
gray blue kind of here it's kind of gray so anyways and then this is a misfit rack where is the thing my stomach hurts right now i don't know why like my side um So here we have the Misfit Rack Bag scripts, which is laundry payday, date night planning time. We have these uh, silver cart icons. We have these gold heart icons. Could be perfect for marking stuff with hearts and little things. Um, we have these Las Vegas deco icons. Um, we have the Mickey rose gold headers. This one is the same. If you be my star, I'll be your sky, but in rose gold, so I might destash that. We have the silver bows. We have the hollow bows. We have this sparkly rainbow hollow glitter foil going on here. We have this here about Scrub Prince Co. Happy Meal. And then this bottom washi, which I don't think is gold. I think it's like, uh, like matte gold or something like that. But anyways, last but not least, um, we have here, I might have gotten two star gold, but like I'm not mad about it. So let's see, what is this? Yep, it's the Celestial, the other one was a star though, right? Yeah, so this one's the Celestial um, Gold Bokeh, is it? Or no, Starry Hollow? It might be Starry Hollow. No, I don't know. I think it's Gold Bokeh, because it looks gold. And then this is probably the Starry Hollow, Celestial Starry Hollow. And then we have the leaves in gold, perfect for fall. I might pick up more of those or make, I am planning to make foils, so I don't know. Then this is the um, Star and Sparkly Black, or no, Sparkle and Sparkly and Sparkly Black. And then this is the Star and Sparkly Black, thought these would be perfect for Halloween. And then we have the Bonfire and Star. They don't have this as the fall anymore. Hopefully it'll restock. If not, oh well. This is the Copper Twinkle. Perfect for fall. And then this is the Gold Confetti Twinkle, which I love it. It's so perfect. So yeah guys, that is it for this portion of this haul. I will be back with more. You know, it's the mail keeps rolling in and i'll talk to you guys in like just a second for y'all <laughs> hi friends welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel excuse my like overgrown although they are french tips so it's kind of hard to tell but excuse my overgrown broken nail we are hoping to get our nails done this coming tuesday so anyways this is another haul bit for august um i only have three orders so far I guess like I've kind of slowed down on ordering although there's a huge sale like this current weekend that like I'm doing this in so I will have some more stuff but it might not be here until September as sales go so anyways first things first we'll talk about Simply Gilded so they had their Halloween release and of course they had a sale they're in the like uh go wild sale uh planner wild for planner sale or whatever that is currently going on so of course I missed that but it's whatever so picked up some of the Halloween and really it's more like versatile washi I don't remember ordering this pumpkin one maybe that's an accident is it a freebie is there I don't see an invoice oh here it is here's my invoice okay so yeah I think that's like a freebie one this one because I did not order this let's see zoom it's like pumpkins and it's kind of like maroon I mean, I can always use this on, like, monthlies. It's like a maroon brown. But, yeah, I don't see... I did not order this, so... Hmm. Wonder if it was an accident. I will definitely go ahead and email them and let them know, but... Maybe, I don't know. Then we have the blush pink pumpkins. Focus. So cute. I thought these could be so cute and just, like, all the things. And then I picked up the, like... I think this is technically called... Silver holographic bubble bow washi set of three. So you have a 10 and 15 millimeter, and then a silver holographic bubble bow and white bow. Oh, so it's like five millimeter, 10 millimeter, and 15 millimeter, which I love. I love that so much. It's so exciting. I thought this could work for like sparkly hollow or like chunky sparkly hollow vibes. 
and then I got the pink and white stripes with the like sparkly hollow like bows this is technically a pink and white candy stripe bow washi set 15 and 10 millimeters with silver glitter foil I love silver glitter um yeah this is the paper just fell but this is the black and white striped version of the pink and white stripes and then this is like let me see what is this one called this is called the pastel haunted mansion washi which i love so much so super glad to pick that up and then i picked up a large black album i think this was also new um not that i like need any more albums <laughs> but um i just love these and like i hate when i don't get one that like i would love to have just to like have a collection so i got the black one with silver hardware could easily use this for like a black planner or whatever but yeah so happy to have picked that up so that is all my simply gilded and then let's open paper shire which is not a huge order either but i did just order for her um also part of the wild for planners collab sale so this is the thank you a5 card journaling card super cute i always keep those and then um this is the freebies they open these yeah. the tiered freebies yeah. there we go and we have this cute beach blue pantone a six card and then we have the instagram freebie super cute you have like a pilot um radio uh record player cruise ship um lighthouse I can't tell what this is like medieval like Shakespearean I don't know let me zoom in and then this is like a vanilla eating like a marshmallow toasted then rock climbing and then a vanilla eating like trail mix so super cute and then we have these I love these little functionals and then we have the like library ones I do want to go to the library I think it's closed right now but I do want to go like I was telling my fiance the other night before going to bed I want to start like reading like historical books like especially like about like russia and like empires and stuff like that um and then um here you have this um vanillas and like a group so that's super cute and then let me open this so i got two of the journaling stickers of the bakery super cute i can always use these like whenever so that's fun and then we have the summer days ones i don't really journal but i want to so i always just pick these up just in case and then i got the study scenes because you can use that for monthlies or even just functionally for studying and then i got the university prep because i am in university and then we have the thriller books. I got the books because I wanted to start reading more. And then we have the classical books because I kind of want to read classical books. And then I got the vinyl records because my fiance does have a record player. I got him for Christmas like two or three years ago or maybe one or two years ago. And this is the horror books. I want to get into like horror books and like it and Stephen King and all that stuff. So I think I have some Stephen King, like maybe one Stephen King book. I don't know. And last but not least, we have Stick With The Plan Co. order. I love Stick With The Plan Co. so much. And Paper Shower. And Simply Goaded, of course. But, um, I love Stick With The Plan Co. as well. There is a thank you, uh, code in here. So I won't be sharing that with y'all. But, um, this is the front side. Super cute. I love this journaling card. It's A6. I might put this in, like, a planner or something like that. Or, like, on a... I have, like, a bunch of the B6 or Estelle things. So I might do that. I don't know super cute this was from her christmas in july sale so the july 2022 freebie with the lottie a planner some plants i'm not a huge plant person but this is like cute and then we have the like um the little squidges uh christmas sampler super cute so happy about that then <coughs> excuse me um i got the laptop time stickers because i was starting to use these up 
from one spread. Then I got the festive date night. I love how like much smaller they are. I feel like they used to be bigger. And then we have the festive happy mail. Super cute. We have the festive food. I feel like I have these, but maybe bigger or not. I don't know. We got the festive costumes. So cute. I love like the new sizing and all that. Like less than an inch. Then we have the festive characters. <clears throat> I'm so ready for like this time of year. Festive baking. Decorating. And then festive shopping. So that is that. Ah. That is all of this portion of this haul i hope you guys enjoyed watching if there is no more um we'll see actually my like spc mystery <clears throat> is shipping and then let me see what else is like coming let me see so i do have a b uh b6 i have a honeybee shop order coming i have um <clears throat> i might have caress press uh i do have paper shire on the way so maybe that'll be here so yeah, we'll see. I think there might be at least one more, but if not, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. And if it if this is the end, I'll see you in the next video. And if it's not, I'll see you in the next haul clip. See you soon. <laughs> Either way. Hi loves. Oh my god. It feels like well, I know it's been like two weeks since I filmed, and it just feels like a really long time. I feel extremely rusty. I feel like I don't even know what words to say. I I had like so much stuff to do um, in terms of like getting my setup ready again to just film. Um, I feel so rusty, but this is the last clip for my August 2022 haul, and I do have some magic things here. Um, I did have like a separate video I was gonna do setting up like a daily B6 planner from RSL. I didn't get time to do that, um, as always. So. I will not be doing that, but I will show you my new planner that I got from RSL and my plans for that and the cover I got um, rather than inserting that clip because I did film it like I filmed it as like, oh, an unboxing, um, but then I didn't feel like, um, what's it calling? Um, I'm not going to add in that clip because, yeah, so also I need to find where the heck did I put my, um, I don't know where I put all my pens that I got from Oristel. I only see one right here. And also I need to remember where the heck I put my external hard drive. I think it's at the bottom of this bin that I have here that I'm looking through. It's like right next to me. Oh, here. Here's my other pen. So I'll be able to show you guys that and show you guys this. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to do. Let's just go ahead and get into it. But first things first, I'll show the magic mail. So, first up first, um, take this out. I got this pouch from Main Street Couture. Um, I do think these are like very cute pouches. I liked the pink pumpkin, the Nikki pumpkin. I will say, having like the real Stony Clover, I definitely think like. I mean, it doesn't really matter. It goes just like in your bag or whatever, but I definitely feel like the real Stony Clover just feels like better texture or something like that. I don't know. The nylon feels more like nylon-y. It's not as like big pattern, but it does not really matter. So I picked up this one. Super cute. Um, so yeah, this was from Main Street Couture, I want to say. They make really cute ears. I mean, and also headbands too that aren't just for ears so I want to try them out but I got this super cute so that was my Main Street Couture order and then this is from Soren over Main Street I already took these out of the um like acetate or something whatever they come in um because I was just too excited and I want to try them on um so I got this like sequin um, pumpkin one super cute it looks like this is like a vinyl that they put on super cute so yeah looks like it's a vinyl and then I got these spider-man ones because spider-man is my fiance's favorite superhero favorite like Avenger Marvel all that stuff so um I got these for myself but I am now you know and it was the 
Spider-Man with him. And then also I kind of probably want some Wanda ones and maybe Miss Marvel and of course Captain Marvel. I need to find some Captain Marvel ones, but super cute. So that is part of my magic mail. And then these two cups, I've already been drinking out of them. So sorry if they're gross. Um, but I got these two cups from... And I do have like leftover Coke in them, I'm sorry. Um, but I got these two cups. I forgot what... Who is it? Enchanted Sticker Co. I got this one. And I got this one off their Etsy. Sometimes they randomly put up like ready to ship Etsy ones. And I had one of these before. Um, you might have seen me post it on my like shop account and on my like TikTok or whatever. But I had one of these before. But it did um, like get messed up. Uh, don't stick these like because they're vinyl. Um, do not stick them like in another cup that's what I accidentally did and it messed up the vinyl so I just ordered another one I don't even know where the messed up one went but um I got that and then I have one more on the way that's like Halloween candy corn so that's all the magic mail and then we'll get into the planner mail so let's take this out we have honeybee shop ah. so I'll show you the honeybee shop first um do, do, do. okay so i picked up these cute little paper clips the spooky with the hollow and the nope black heart are just a vibe i had always wanted to do like a pastel halloween setup and like a planner or something so needed that halloween so i picked these up and um yeah, we have this cute little felty clip. Let me zoom you guys in. Super cute. And then we have this nope one. A vibe. And then I picked up this um, like lettering brush pen that they sell. Um, they say it's like supposed to be easier to learn how to letter on. So I'm going to use this piece of paper right here as a test. Let's see. Exclamation. And then let me try. I definitely think it's like easier to control than like a lot of other pens. Um, it can be hard for me to learn. It's funny, I can like letter on my iPad, but it can be hard for me to learn lettering with like a physical pen. Um, I think that's okay. Not the hello, but the hi is okay. So yeah, um, I got that pin. You can get that from the honeybee shop. And then the real reason I had placed an order um, was one, I wanted to pick up this like perforated time washi because I am planning to try to use it in my B6 daily from Aura Estelle. So let me show you guys. This is my new one that I got recently. The other one I like sometimes would make stuff in it, like sometimes make stickers for it. And then I just wouldn't really use it. I would try to. Um, but this one I got new recently and I do want to use it. Even if it's just like back planning and like journal planning or something like that and using stickers. So this is a B6 daily from Aura Estelle. So I mean, I don't have to really use like the hourly component, but I figured I would pick up this tape rather than keep like making hourlies for like hours um, for the tape. So this goes from two. I don't, I don't know why it starts at two because I don't do that. But this is the new one I picked up. Um, so showing you guys what I've done so far. Put these vinyls on the front. Um, this one is from. I'm trying to remember. It's off of Etsy. I can't remember right now, but it's one of those big, um, you know, all the Planet Girls buy their magical stuff from them. This is from No White Space Stickers. This is from Fox and Pip. And then this one is, I can't remember who this one's from either. Um, so yeah. And then the tape's also from them. This is from the Coffee Monsters Co. And this is from No White Space Stickers. And this is also the same vinyl from that shop that I can't remember right now. Then I put a little pocket here of my style planner icon so that way I want to just keep it as kind of minimal as possible and then on this page I put the My Strange Addiction dashboard from Fox and Cactus, a pink bow, and then some hollow pink and white washi. 
so that's what that looks like and then in here I already started doing like the year at a glance ones so I did the August through January these are with my own hand lettered scripts um, which I do hope to eventually bring to my shop and then here we have February through July so made those for myself um, a long time ago as like a test and then this is the monthly and one thing that was new is that now in between the monthlies they now put like grids so that way you can like write down everything that happened and like what do you want to do next month and then moving along to the dailies am I there yet I need to like put some tabs I have some tabs I'll show you um I'm just gonna use my Avery like sparkly tabs ultra, ultra tabs and I have another like thing of small ones I could use as well um, but yeah these are the monthlies I need to make some stickers for those and then still monthlies still monthlies okay I think here is where it becomes yep here is where it becomes the weeklies so the lines are a lot more faint now um, so this is like the week at a glance all of that stuff and then here is like the day of the week so like Monday so if I just go in and I take this preparation and it's perforated from like six to something else I don't I don't know completely but I'll try one out and show you guys here if this tape gets off of me so let me go I think it goes six to nine but what if I wanted to go longer nope it only goes six to nine okay that sucks I wish it went longer I'm like I some I mean I don't really need to mark something hourly after nine o'clock at night um so we'll see I don't know so I'm gonna put it from the bottom to the top if I can do this One second. It's really easy to bring up, so at least you have that. And it goes perfectly down the side. So it goes six to nine. It's fine, it's whatever. Not a huge deal, so love this so much it does go from like the top to here but I don't really like I didn't like having like the top three up here anyways so if you did have like the new the older version like it might have been a little awkward because there was this like box and I don't think that box is there anymore um because I just figured I would put like all my like top three all my important things like in this bar I would do my like schedule to do's and then like highlights or flat lays or whatever breakfast lunch and dinner whatever over here and do like running to-do lists over here so I might like get some printable kits or like use some kits that I already have that I'm probably never going to use or something and um like stuff that I've put off and then like play with this because I really just want to play with stickers sometimes um, and I think this is a good way to do it, but then also kind of be like functional But then I don't rely on this to be a hundred percent functional for me. So it could even be kind of like a back planner, but We'll see. So that is what I picked up from for a cell and then I'll show you the cover I got for it. So I got the sea foam cover Let me put it in here. I also have like these bookmarks when it's in here, but I don't always keep my planners like in their covers because sometimes it's just easier to like write and pick them out so um it has the 10 two pin loops so i might put like one of those dot color pens or um like a normal pen and then or shop through the beautiful pen and then something maybe a tombow pen we'll see i also have um the mild liners but yeah this was my aura cell order i didn't mean to even go like show you guys this but when i showed you the preparation tape from the honeybee shop i just had to get into that so that is what i got from the honeybee shop and then i have another one as well because i don't know how long it'll last and then i got this official planner babe um club member vinyl decal and i think i have another one i think i'll 
maybe put this on here because it's giving like sparkly hollow but this one I am doing just like a horizontal um undated classic b6 weekly b6 classic um that I got from what's it called I'm gonna put the sticker on while I have you guys here and you guys can be a part of it but um I got this from also from Oristel and the Annie Plans collaboration and recently people started making me want the A5 one to also do that with the A5 one but I think I should actually like do this first and then move on so this is supposed to be like for writing down like shop stuff and then like also doing the monthlies maybe for shop stuff so um I have the small biz owner vinyl on the front and then this fox and pip sparkly hollow one and now this one on the front and then on this inside I have this um from a long time ago shine sticker studio from Michaels it's like a little folder um you can put stickers in so I put that there because it's giving like sugar box stickers and then you have like the like yearly overview for like four years and then I use the um letters to Apollo uh, monthly scripts that I have the bow scripts for this and then I'm gonna make some stuff here or I might just fill it in by hand I don't know I don't really care at this point and then it has um I didn't know the horizontal uh had this in the in between but the daily didn't last year so this is just one that I had um just laying around because I I've bought these like a few times because they're not that expensive and I just always like I don't know what I'm doing so then my plan is to like plan out what I want to release in my shop like in the horizontal it's just like little guides and like to do's and then um I do know they're coming out with like a notebook now so I might also just get the notebook and then maybe buy these two vinyls and see if I can find another one from Fox and Pip although um this one was removable and this one might also be removable because it looks like it's made by the same people but yeah, I might try to keep this for now. Um, I do have some other planners coming as well that I'm going to be trying out. Then you have this Lonely Planner Club dashboard. Admits one Lonely Planner. And then it says 729.15, which I imagine is probably their, like, um, anniversary. So super cute little dashboard. And then you have this Planner Babe business card from them with all their socials. And, yeah, that was my Honey Bee Shop order. So now... Let's move on to this. Um, we will get into, what is this? Honey and the Bear. Oh, I think that's from uh, Honey Bee Shop. So then let's get into this SPC order that I forgot last time because it was like under some stuff. So I have to put stuff away. I think it's just colors of the week or, yeah, colors of the week and then like some add-ons and stuff I missed the black one and I wish I picked it up um there was an orange one but I do have orange I just don't have black and I regret not picking it up but I was trying to save money so anyways we have this freebie right here super cute and then we have this other freebie here which I think is Kirsten's freebie and this like lilac color it almost matches the color of the week and then we picked up the color of the week back then it's like this gorgeous lavender pastel blue I don't know like lilac blue or whatever I can't really call it but this is page 10 this is page 9 this is page let me zoom in then page 8 or sheet 8 sheet 7 I always just do the by all sheet 6 sheet 5 come on 5 4 3 two and one the disney sheet super cute so we got that going and then we picked up the autumn home kit at first i was going to use this for thanksgiving but i did just pick up the um what's it called i just picked up the friendsgiving kit and also you guys i have something super exciting while we're looking at spc stuff i have something so exciting to show you guys you guys get ready get ready on your marks get set go i am a part of the spc affiliate team i'm so excited you guys 
SPC like has been my tried and true for several years now um, and I'm so just so happy to be a part of this team <sighs> I just I don't have words like literally I got into planning again five years ago because of SPC and because of the magic kit from J. Crew plans um, so yeah I'm just so 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 grateful to be on the SPC team so whenever you spend any money at SPC please make sure to use my code China 10 um, and yeah please just show me all your love and support I'm just kidding um, but no I really I'm just so excited and I hope you guys are excited for me and yeah I can't wait to keep you know doing stuff for SPC for the next few months so we have that um, so yeah I picked up this autumn home kit my nails kind of match it match the vibes a little also my nail broke already like less than a week later I'm so annoyed um it's just so ratchet looking I'm like nobody look I was so excited to like debut my like end of summer fall nails like fall vibes and then my nail like freaking broke I just can't take it anymore anyways so this is autumn home I was like in love with this as soon as I saw it um so yeah I'm definitely gonna use this probably sometime in November I don't really have a lineup in mind y'all like my life is just chaos right now so that's what we got going on so we picked that up and then it has this extras these extra boxes oh I love an extra boxes moment um and then here's the other stuff I picked up so I picked up the doodles we gotta always pick up the doodles and I picked up the extra fashion I like this girl she reminds me of me and then I picked up the um little uh I think her name's Hazel I think her name's Hazel um the little scribbler girls so I got the girl with the laundry and then I got the girl with like the fast food bag super cute so then um my other SPC order is the SPC I think September mystery you guys I I don't know if I'm keeping this one in my arsenal um I almost feel like okay I don't know I definitely want the foil for sure when I first saw this I was just like uh, I don't know um I love this teal color though I love teal um but here is the foil it is the uh copper foil like coppery orange in the uh, twinkle format and I just picked up another one I'm probably not using this kit and I'm probably not going to use this foil for this kit so I'll probably have two so I just remembered like earlier I was like should I buy two and then like now I'm glad that I didn't because I also have this one so we have this page and we have our bougie and then we have our icons and scripts this is the older format and then um we have the bows and then the I think this is the twinkles and then more bows more twinkles and the number date numbers so this kit at first was not feeling it I really don't even really have that many people I could use this for Give me one second, I'm gonna take a sip of some coke. Oof. I always feel like I have burps when I drink coke, but I like burping. Sorry if that's gross. But anyways, I am going to Arizona and I do go like west. I don't know if there's like a birthday cake in here. If there is, I might use this for my future father-in-law's birthday. I feel like he likes westerns and stuff like that. So this could work. It wasn't what I really wanted to use to mark that. I think there is a cake, so I might actually end up using this. I didn't really want to, but hey, I think it works for like a 70th birthday. Also, it's Arizona, so it's like the cactus and the um, like red rocks and the wild west. So you guys, I might actually end up using this. At first I was like, I might try to sell, sell on the buy sell trade, but I feel like if you have a kit and you have like a use for it and it, it has like an extra thing, like, like here's the cake for the birthday I think I'm gonna do it I think I'm just gonna go for it so I guess I'm using this kit um here we have this extra colors and the ombre heart checklist and then the doodle sampler here and then we have this fashion girl tall box this even though it's supposed to be Westworld inspired this reminds me of um holes <laughs> which I actually really like I've never watched Westworld though but yeah this reminds me of holes I think you know because it has the cake and it's fall vibes I think I gotta use it I wasn't feeling it but I think I'm just gonna go for it it's whatever I'm, I'm I believe that I'll make it turn out well and it also has a lot of boxes and you know when you're going to travel in the middle of the week you know sometimes you're gonna have more stuff to mark so 
that was everything from Scopa Prince Co. Like I said, if you feel compelled to pick anything up that is in shop, not the mystery, um, but any of the doodles, kits, foil, whatever, please remember, you know, or make sure <laughs> if you feel like it, no pressure, if you feel like it, um, please use my code CHINA10 to save 10% off. I'm so excited. I can't believe I get to say that. Um, I've never been like an affiliate for anything. All right, last thing here is Caress Press. They were having their like uh, shop anniversary sale. So I picked up the maple kit um, from last year. I picked up the dead and breakfast kit and I picked up the trick or treat monthly. So I don't usually open kits and go through them with you guys. I don't really want to. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Like I just hate putting them back in the cells, but we'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. Okay. We'll do it quickly. All right. So dead and breakfast. I'm just really excited for Dead and Breakfast, so I want to show you guys that. So, here we have Dead and Breakfast. Oops, something just fell. Lots of extras. I got this tall box medium skin brunette. I think I paid for this add-on. And then I also got the 15mm washi. And then these came, these three boxes also came as an add-on. Um, you have a hand, like a hotel check-in, a cute little pumpkin, and then this scene here. So they're both scenes. And then we have our boxes, flags, deco, square, uh, rounded labels, um, and then the weekend banner. And then we have this page here. Super cute. I'm obsessed. I'm really obsessed with these colors. I don't know when I'm going to use this. Um, and then we have here this page. I might just hold on to this. I don't know. I like I, This is the thing. It's like I don't know when I'm going to use kits. Um, I might use this the week I come back from Arizona, maybe. Um, although it was not, like, in the plans because that is also, like, I think, is that my shop anniversary week? No. That's also my best friend's birthday, though. And I was considering using Seance for that. But I might use this. Um, I think my best friend will understand. So, yeah, we have that. And then... I have so many kits that I want to use. Oh, I should stop buying so many, but like I can't. I can't stop. So that's everything for Dead and Breakfast. Sorry if I didn't like say what page is what, but I feel like you guys know. So I don't know. Let me know if you guys prefer for people to do that. I don't. I don't necessarily care for people to like explain what each page is. So I'll just go ahead and just go through it we have the 15 millimeter washi we have this extra two boxes here and the dog is so cute and I love the little latte with the leaf I've always wanted to be able to do that and I'm really bad at it and then the little maple cookies I'm just I want a maple latte now like everybody loves pumpkin spice no give me a maple nitro latte then we have this tall box girl here her shoes don't really match the fall vibes but it's whatever I love this kit and then we have all of the stuff here and then you have your full box scenes I love this I don't always love like two double boxes because I hate splitting them up if I don't have like to do stuff but I might it depends on what I'm doing in the week that I use this kit I think this is an older format yeah this is an older format but it's whatever still super in love with the colors so we have all of the things I miss the little things without the icons it's gonna be okay though we're gonna be fine so that is Maple from Caress Press. And then last but not least, we have Trick or Treat Monthly. Do I even have a September monthly? I don't know. <sighs> you guys, I'm a mess. Like, what am I doing? I don't know. Do you guys know what you're doing? Um, so here we have the like airplane uh, freebies and then days until vacay, pack bags, book vacation. I am going on vacation in like 27 days, so. That's fun. It'll be like three weeks, actually. Is it? Today's September 1st. And so the first, so we go one, two, three, four. A little, um, no. One, two, three. A little almost like four weeks. Three weeks and, a, and six days. So then we have, oh my god, this is so cute. What? Have you guys seen this before? This is like sushi and tea. Full box overlays. I don't know what I would use this with, but it has sushi night, lunch date, and Japanese takeout. I love sushi. I love Japanese food. 
I don't have words. I was just thinking to myself, I need to make like a food sampler and like a date night sampler. And like, I was gonna do like date nights that I usually do with my fiance, like movie night. We usually do movie night, um, sushi night, J, J barbecue, K barbecue, all the things. We're usually very much like Asian food dominant or American food sometimes when I'm in the mood for that. But anyways, that is so cute. I don't know if that's something that's like in shop. Um, I would definitely buy it. I would definitely at least buy one to like use with like a foodie kit. So then I got the Deco sidebar for my monthlies. And then here we have the, um, this is like together. I like that. Uh, so we have the, um, like decos and like deco boxes and square boxes and stuff like that. And then this is for October, but I do not get them dated. But I'm still, I mean, it's definitely for October, you already know. So, love the house scenes so much from Sadie Paper. Um, and then we have here this internal house scene as well. And there's like so much stuff at Michael's decoration wise that look like this. And I was like texting my mom today or I was messaging her on Instagram. And I was like, I showed her a reel of like all the like Halloween party stuff from Michael's. It's like pastel, like this colorway. And I was like, I kind of want to have another party just to use that stuff, but like not invite anybody. Like maybe my mom. I'd invite my mom. Um, but I don't want to invite all those people. <laughs> oh my god, my camera just cut me off. So rude. Um, I was talking about how I want to have another Halloween party, but not invite people besides my mom and have sushi and like ice cream and ice cream cake. And yeah, I, I started um, during COVID, I started to get like sushi on my birthday. And a boba and like ice cream cake is what my fiance has been getting me from Cold Stone on my birthday. I love Cold Stone ice cream. I've been getting it in like pints. Although I've been very good about not eating it. So whatever. Done with my ramble. I'm That's just like my birthday vibes now. Like it's a tradition for me now. So yeah. So then we have this page. And that is all. So you guys. That is everything for this haul bit. That's everything for this month. That's everything you'll see for now because I already checked the mail today and it is currently September 1st which means anything that comes after today is now officially a part of September's um haul so yeah guys I hope you guys enjoyed watching um please remember to like comment subscribe and turn on the bell for notifications to get notified every time I upload I know it's kind of really scarce right now everything kind of like just went to shit like sorry excuse my colorful language um like my hard drive stopped working like a few weeks ago and i had to get a new hard drive and just like school and like life and work and everything just picked up so much shit at work you guys will hear about it once those plan with me's resume i'm hoping to have one at least next week so yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed watching please do all the things that i already mentioned probably before in this video and i'll talk to you guys in my next video i love you guys so much bye